So Prescott of the Cowboys now with a first and 10 at their own 27. Now the first carry for Ezekiel Elliott. It's a six-yard pickup, and it gets him to second and four. All right, Brad, I know we're in the early going here, but those kind of runs, they're going to open up a world of opportunities for this offense going forward. Here go 46. Here go 48. Here go, here go, going to 54, going to 54, going to 54, going to 54. Get this only up to about the 35. A three-yard pickup on second and four. Now they'll need to convert here on third and a little more than a yard. Now hold everything here. We're going to get a timeout by the offense. They'll have two remaining as we step aside here in this first quarter. first before he's brought down at the 39-yard line. Give him three yards and a fresh set of downs. So from the 39 now, they'll come up on a first and 10. They go play action here on first down. Rush coming, and he's taken down. Yannick Ngakwe in there to bury him for a loss of 11. Sometimes I watch games and wonder why they use play fakes on certain passing situations because it's not going to fool anyone. I don't know if that was the case here, but the end result was the same. No one fooled. The quarterback was hit. Prescott now on second down. Looking and finding Allen Hearns. And he'll get it up to the 33-yard line. Six yards is the pickup, and that'll lead to a third down. One thing we do know, he's going to get his catches. So as they move forward defensively, got to continue to focus on not giving up the big play when he does catch the ball in the secondary. And the Jags get to him as down he goes. Avery Jones with a big-time sack on third down. And it'll be a loss of seven. So on fourth down, here's Chris Jones to punt it away. Back deep with Sean Green. This will be fielded at the 17. We'll call that a punt of 54 yards. Well struck. Out comes the Jaguar offense now as they get set to take over. The crowd may be losing just a little bit of the edge after back-to-back -back punts. They want some big plays. They want to see some offense. They want to see somebody break away, whether it's through the air or on the ground. Now it'll be interesting to see where the patience is on both sides. Each head coach, can you hang in there and not try and force something that could put your team in some jeopardy? On the ground, this is Leonard Fournette. And he's going to be met at the line of scrimmage and taken down. Demarcus Lawrence in on the tackle. And he got off the end there very quickly to make that play. Yeah, it was almost like the bullet train, wasn't it? I mean, just zoom. Quick, quick, quick. And what a terrific play, holding them to no gain. Here we go. Well, they had to run for no gain. Now they'll try again from the 25 on second and 10. Hey, 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 hey. 
On second down, here's Bortles. Wide open receiver complete. And they work this well up field across the 45. 23 yards on the play. That was a nicely run slant route, and what the receiver's trying to do is make the defender think he's going upfield for a deeper route and then breaks it off, usually after about three to four steps and cuts towards the middle of the field. And now what he's trying to do is use his body to keep the defender away from the football and give the quarterback a really nice target. On the ground, this is T.J. Yeldon. And nowhere really to go there. He'll take this up just shy of midfield. Credit him with a one-yard gain there to make it second and nine. Nice job by that defensive front there to hold him to a short gain on first down. Well played, I must say. Yeah, only getting one yard. There was no room to run. Portals to throw on second down. And incomplete there. A nice hit. Jars the ball free and brings up third down. That would have been a great catch, but it's real difficult to hold on to it because it was contested all the way. Would have been a great play if he'd been able to haul that one in. After an incomplete pass on second down, that'll leave him trying to convert on third and nine. Water, water. Check, check. Lucy, Lucy. 11B, 11B. Three to six. Shotgun now for Bortles. Open man is Westbrook complete. Touchdown, Jaguars. A big play there. His third touchdown now on the year. And the Jags have taken the early lead. And that was just four verticals. They were going for a big play, and it resulted in a big play. And you know why that's so difficult to cover? Because you can throw the ball to any one of those four vertical receivers at any point in the pattern. Wherever they're open, just get them the ball, and then let them run after it. And he runs it all the way in for a touchdown. Cowboys are going to call another timeout. And that's their second charge timeout here in this first quarter. They're down to one remaining. Here's Lambeau out to kick this one away. That'll be taken in the end zone. And all that work, but he stopped where he ultimately would have been, and he simply taken a knee, and that's the 25-yard line. And now Dallas gets set to take the field. And they'll be looking to avoid what happened last time, which is punting the football. But when you look at how teams play the game, that complimentary football comes into play. How do I take care of my defense? How do I take care of my offense? Well, the defense is taking care of them in a lot of ways. Now it's time for the offense to jump things up and help their defense out. Give them a little bit of rest. Yeah, it's time for them to give them a rest. Took the words right out of my mouth. They're throwing to start the drive, but that one incomplete. But he kind of forced that one there, didn't he? It's almost like he predetermined where he was going to go with the football. Yeah, he wasn't really going through progressions. He wanted to go to his top guy. You do that against this defense, they'll make you pay, won't they? Yeah, they certainly will. They react very quickly to the thrown football. They play fake to Elliott. Now Prescott. Jaguar pressure and a Jaguar sack. Calais Campbell in there to bring him down for a loss of seven. They'll need a big play here. Will Dak and the Cowboys after the sack? It's third and long. 
From the shotgun, it's Prescott. And that's caught by Beasley. And they're able to get this one across the 35. 18 yards on his first catch of the game. It's a first down. Prescott looks to throw on first. He's going to flip that out to the flat. It's complete. And he'll bring it up here to right at the 40-yard line. They'll get four there out of the screen, and it's second down. We've seen quite a bit of the short passing game here early on first quarter, haven't we? We have, and I think it works a couple of ways for, for this team because, number one, you throw the short game until they stop it. And if they're not going to stop it, you keep throwing it, and occasionally you'll break a tackle and turn into a bigger gain. Also, if they start to creep up, start to pressure receivers, now you go over the top, take it deep, and now you get some of those big shots downfield. They'll run it now out of the gun. And nothing doing. He's immediately taken down at the line of scrimmage. No gain on the play, and it's going to bring up a third down. All runners count on their eyes to find the gaps and creases to find open space. There was absolutely none on that one. Totally swallowed up on that play. Off play action to Elliott. Here's Prescott looking for Hearns, and it's intercepted. A.J. Boye with a pick, and the return will be stopped at the 34-yard line. And, Brandon, this is a real nice job defensively of getting inside a quarterback's head and figuring out, okay, where is he going with the football? Because you can make an educated guess defensively, not all the time, but sometimes. And when you're right, you've got a decent chance of coming away with the football. From the 34 now, here's first and 10. And now we're going to get a timeout here called by the defense. And my goodness, they're now out of timeouts here in this first quarter. Here we go. And down to a knee. That's one way to call a play. Alongside the former defensive back Charles Davis, I'm Brandon Gordon. It's Jack. Trying to move it up. It was like lemon in the morning. Skip the school, that's a truancy body. I made me some rats in the morning. 